so recently uh, we developed a single board computer uh, under the scheme of technology development fund scheme uh, by government of india to uh, to develop a solutions to integrate legacy video interfaces as well as the upcoming video interfaces in an avionic system to connect video sensors to video display right this is a very unique thing i mean nobody really need it unless until it is an avionic system maybe it can be used in in uh, another military uh, solution like ships you know but right now it is targeted mainly for you know upgrading the sukhoi airplane and also related uh, airplane design this is smfd the actual replica of the smfd that is planned to be used in sukhoi upgrade plan this has been developed completely by us logical technology based on another technology that was developed under tdfs scheme so that is single board computer but using that we have developed this md and now we have been talking to various industry partners and also with hl you know to kind of um, ruggedize it and to make it uh, air worthy air uh, flight worthiness i was kind of an happy employee you know doing pretty good uh, as an employee and also very satisfied with the kind of work recognitions everything but in 2009 we saw an opportunity right where we have an opportunity to try something different and uh, without having a lot of big dream we decided to start our own organization we really didn't have any big dream and to be frank personally we didn't know where we are going to do so there was always a thought that oh, if the things doesn't work we'll come back to job in in a couple of years but after starting right uh, there have been a lot of challenges up and down but uh, we never look back and we never thought of you know leaving it in between uh, so now we are after almost 13 years we are 250 odd employee um doing over 50 crore rupees of revenue what we are doing is we are developing customized high compute embedded systems for various industries with fpga is one of our usps nowadays uh, processor processors uh, are running out of steam basically right they are not able to increase the processing power you cannot increase additional cores so now the time is that even you have to do computation you will have to do targeted computation and with fpgas reprogrammability is a key you can always you know uh, in fact you can at run time you can load a function you can get it executed and then you can reprogram it again right and this is going to be used in lot of ai ml kind of payload real time inline processing fpgas has been used you know in aerospace defense medical now the data center is most probably is going to be one of the biggest user of fpga moving forward right so i'm providing a heterogeneous processing platform for various kind of applications uh, the kind of solution that we develop right uh, it is mainly used by uh, industries like aerospace and defense test and measurement right so these two uh, industry require a lot of you know solutions which does not go in high number right i mean uh, it is not like phone or it is not like laptop right uh, they are very customized designed and developed for very targeted use case so this is uh, aquila data acquisition system uh, which is built uh, for uh, acquiring the data from different sensors uh, like pressure rtd thermocouple flow and any sensor which is giving voltage output so this basically we have developed for uh, iprc isro uh, where uh, we will get data from uh, different sensors while doing the engine test uh, and uh, initially they had a very like three story building uh, where this entire data acquisition system got scattered and we have miniaturized the entire uh, three build, three story building structure to a single rack uh, data acquisition system so this is if recorder and playback system and it is basically a data acquisition system and as the name suggests it is used to record the incoming if signals from sensors and store it into the hard disk of the system and the same recorded data can be played back as well so uh, we have also developed the gui and here you can see this is the front side of the system it shows all these ports and here you can see we have eight if input channels through which we'll be acquiring the data and we have four uh, output channels here and four output channels over here through which you can play back the data on these channels i mean defense uh, we have been working with defense industry for almost uh, 10 years now i mean of course when we started um, we were mainly working with our overseas customers and uh, when we were trying to grow in india 
we could find defense was one of the area where we can really use our capability and you know enhance our capability so we have been working them and in last 10 years we have worked with all the different labs of IRD uh, or the DRDO labs like IRD LRD ADE um, deal and so many basically we are partner to all four major companies uh, we we are gold partner to to Intel FPGA program uh, recently I mean we have been certified Jailings partner uh, for many many years and recently uh, AMD uh, who has acquired Jailings has uh, promoted Logic Fruit Technologies as the premier partner and Avinix is one of the area where we are focusing a lot basically um, we are uh, working we are you know in, we have kind of jointly uh, exploring up solutions and opportunities in Air Force as well as uh, solutions around AD and 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 HL. So I see we are one of the very few company you know, who is actually uh, developing product, the complete product in India, right? Uh, there is a lot of defense system that has been developed basically on using POTS module or POS systems and only the integration is done. Uh, but we are actually developing a lot of uh system that are key to a lot of systems right so uh, as i was taking an example of single board computer right so right now we are developing a single board computer uh, using xeon processor which we believe uh, can replace a lot of uh, single board computer that's being imported from various uh, european and us companies